far. There's only been one that I've really liked the look of. In the farming sun. Mind you, I haven't checked out the updated country country lane, country, country something. County lines, this side. And I also noticed there hasn't been any updates for a while, but I grabbed it when it first came out and there were some issues with it, like the icon for the shop in the middle of one of the fields. And I actually liked, I enjoyed that map in um, 19. It was really well done. I would really like Rattlesnake Valley, to be honest, to make an appearance again. I actually thought about seeing if I can't download it, find it, download it, and convert it to 22. I really loved that map. Oh, really? In an RX-7? Why would you do that? I've seen people put V8s into them, RX3s, RX7s. But a snow, uh, what a snow, a, a snow mobile, mobile, whatever engine into one. Why? Why don't you just put a um? Oh, I suppose they're actually quite decent. They need to push you through the snow, wouldn't they? Next up, I'm going to put a jet ski engine into it. I can't see a thing, guys, at all. This rain is, to quote Billy Butcher, diabolical. And what would the time be? Because that's probably not helping. So about another hour and 45. Got to look out. Let me bring this up so I've got the time and keep an eye out for somewhere to sleep. Yeah, I know, raining without me being in crash cam. Mind you, I didn't expect the rain to turn up so quick though. Uh, not only do we need a place to sleep, we also need somewhere where it's got a, a petrol station there as well. Put the servo there. Um, that's that's a long sentence for me to read at the moment. I'll just have to do it in bits. Give us a second, uh, Mike. So I'm thoroughly concentrating because, like I said, I can't see a thing. Trying to keep an eye out for somewhere to sleep. Mind you, I've got another hour. So what do we got? I message Frith. The other to ask if you would be willing to play on a Facebook map. And he said as long as it's a public map. And, whoops. He liked it when... Hang on. Now he just moved it up, so i got to start again. <laughs> as long as it was a public map. Yeah, I get that. And he liked it when he considered it. I'm guessing he liked it that he would consider doing a series of it, you know. Fair enough. I showed him a map, he loved it. But he won't be doing a series with it because um, hard worker... It's not f high worker friendly. But that map, you'll probably see it because it's probably the one I'll use next. And the farming, uh, farms, farms, there, yeah, farms stimulates us. Jeepers, creepers. Hey, I'll have some water, see if that helps. Get the words to slip out of my mouth correctly. I tend to get stuck at the moment. 
Yeah, well, I'll probably be using that map as the next map for our farming some streams. We need a place to stay. Oh, there we go. Options. Options galore on the way. Let me just um see if that's no. Okay, maybe not the oh no, that'll be a truck dealer. Uh so I'm gonna go here to sleep and then Oh, uh it's suggesting that I should go and get fuel first and then come back and sleep. So maybe that's actually Bizarrely, a great suggestion by the GPS. Let's hope I don't get stuck. Probably speaking for myself on that one, though. Look at this civilization, the first civilization I've seen since we left. Ghost Edmonton. Oh, maybe the second. We stayed overnight. Oh, wait, 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 wait. We stayed overnight in uh, Fort uh, Nelson or whatever it was. Fort Nix, Fort, Fort Everyone on Loss. Stay left, and then turn left. I see, you can't, right, and that's why he's telling me to go that way. Turn fair and fair enough. Uh, what do you mean you've seen that map? How do you know what map I showed him? I haven't told anyone about it. I mean, he showed Smudo, but as far as I know, he's the only one who showed. I told Smith that was meant to be a secret. Turn left, then turn right. Turn right. So how do you see it, Mike? Start with that, and then we go, how did you find out <laughs> which map it was? And then turn right. Turn right, and then turn left. Uh, well, there's quite a few on the site where I got that map from. There's actually quite a few everywhere. What site was it on? So oh, I get a feeling you probably haven't heard of the site. Right, one on this view. No offense, Mike, but I think I've got a feeling you don't know which map I'm also talking about. Because I've only seen it on the one site. And that site's got lots of maps. What's the site called?
Because if you can tell me what the site's called, then I'll, I'll change my tune about you knowing what the map is. I mean, I don't know why I was going to ask you, well, what do you think of the map, but then um, it's not your type of map because it's not American. It's Polish. Come on. Let me sleep. You may know the solids. Oh, right, right. Okay, yeah, I misread that, eh? It's not, you know the site, you may know the site. It's called King's Mods. You go there, brush up on your Russian. What do you mean, Andy What are you? Am I missing something on that one, Dave? Only <coughs> fans. It's still raining, Cozy. There you go. Holy heck, what was that? Did I just see 14 grand? Oh, uh, oh no. Too late. 180. Look at that. We're definitely going to get another truck. We're definitely going to get another truck. This is, um,. 160. Definitely get another truck. Eighteen grand. What were we on before? That's a lot of cash. Isn't it? Finally. I was thinking the same thing to be honest. Look at it, it's still going. It's like the stock market news that they have rolling at the bottom of the, you know, when you're watching the news or something. Apple up five cents. Coca Cola down. Antidepressant drug is currently down. No, it's up. No, it's down. No, it's up. And plenty of driving time. So we've got about uh, 14, roughly 14 hours. How far away are we? Thirty-two hours. There's about three days of driving left, actually. Oh, come on. Okay. Make sure I get through. I'm going to aim for the one on the right there. Just sort of... Straighten it up with the big long trailer behind me here. Please get through this. Please get through. Don't get stuck. Don't. Don't. Please don't. Please don't. You know, with about three more days of driving, we are going to have a ton of cash coming in. This might be the only delivery we get to do today, possibly. Oh, okay, maybe I've got a red light. Maybe there is right on red in Canada. Because I didn't get a um, ticket, did I? Only ceiling fans. <laughs> Mm. 
time for crash cam, especially with the weather. Uh, there we go. What was that lamppost doing on the road? Trying to cross it? Well, don't slow down. Thanks, truck. See, if that was me, I would have sped up and been courteous to the, the driver trying to get onto the main road. Look at this. Look at this. This looks familiar, actually. I might have been here. Actually, is this... Ooh, I wonder. Is it... I have been here. I think I've been here with um, Duck City. I didn't think he had Canada Dream. No, 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 because we only played on Truckers MP, and Truckers MP didn't have Canada Dream, that's for sure. And it's, but it reminds me of that place, and we were driving, you're barreling along. And there's this huge dip, all of a sudden, this dip in the, on, the, on the highway here, the freeway, whatever it is. And you literally almost break your truck. You do so much damage because of it. It was nice having a bit of civilization after all that. Um, I'll tell you what, the landscape's exactly the same everywhere, isn't it? I was so looking forward to the scenery in this. It's just the same everywhere. The only difference is there's three lanes here instead of two. Alright, a bit of aquaplaning. Uh, please pull in, oh really, where is it, where, get out of the way, so I can see where it is, there it is, there it is, there it is, there it is. They, they have that up a little too long, I think. Some places they bring it up so quick and you can't see where you need to go in and then it goes off and it's right on top of you. How many of you thought I was going to crash in? I'd be one of them, by the way. <laughs> I'm surprised I them. To be honest. Changing lanes like that. I didn't say who was hoping, because I already know the answer to that one. The answer is always. Tell you what, Crash Cam has a puff from yesterday. Crash Cam's been a bit redundant lately, hasn't it? It hasn't been busy. Even with the rain. Point you, I would. That aquaplane you'd have my heart in my mouth for a second, mate. So, th there's absolutely no question that we're going to get another truck today. So we're going to be equal with ETS in that situation. The only question, and the way it's looking at it at the moment, I think I know the answer to this already, but the only question is which one of the two is going to have the most cash at the end of this week. And I'm, it's looking like to me that ATS might be in the lead at the end of this week. 
Well, into the streaming way, leaving this week. Music to Mike's ears. We've still got a long 1,500 miles to go. All across Canada. Almost. Close enough. This is almost like Canada's version of Route 60. So, oh, I better slow down. I'll know what I can play otherwise. What? Well, yeah, at the end of this stream, ATS might be in the lead for the first time in a while. Because we're definitely getting a new truck, Mike. That's a given now. Even if we don't get any extra money from uh, workers, but we've got three days to get there, so we're bound to get a lot of extra money. And I don't think we'll be using all of the $300,000 budget, because everything's cheaper in ATS. So I can easily see ATS having a lot more cash at the end of the stream. The worst thing about crashing with this thing is the multi-million dollar piece of equipment I've got on the back of the truck. Isn't it? Hope they took the ammo out before I chucked it on here. I'm thoroughly impressed with my driving skills right now. Hey, Ozzy, here, you buddy. <coughs> Another six grand. At the next um, <clears throat> rest stop we have, I'll be going off making my coffee. I imagine it'll be roughly around that time. Yeah, I only thought about it the other well, yesterday when we took the ferry. <laughs> but that was about why we had so many dines. Oh. I still think that contributed to the fact, because of the ferry, that we ended up paying a lot more in loan interest <coughs> repayments. And that's why ETS was behind quite a bit for a long time. Because we, we could have been paying an extra 10 to 20 grand more per stream on some streams than we were with ATS. That would have had a huge effect, even if it was an extra five grand more. Because we were headed to uh, in game days. And now it's just, we, we paid the loan off, and all of a sudden the ETS is ahead. I mean, apart from that, it's not much of a difference, because even though we're ahead in game days, we still got the same amount of drivers bringing in, you know, bringing in cash in both games, pretty much. But obviously, at the end of it yesterday, we got one more driver, but couldn't even get a chance to send them off to make us any money. So the in-game days doesn't make that much of a difference as far as that concerned. I mean, if I didn't have a loan. Uh, yeah, it would make a difference, I suppose, because I'd be getting paid earlier. Oh, I suppose that also accounts for the fact that um, 
I don't know. The only way you really think it go figure it out is to go back and rewatch all the VODs and do some number crunching and uh, number writing and things like that. Yeah, they both have their pros and cons, as well. That's the reason why I did that. Oh, right. They both had the same one con, though, and that'd be me. <laughs> and my skillful driving. <laughs> How did I not... I didn't really do any damage, did I? I have to put that down to the fact that it was, it was acting like a ramp and I've got some rather extremely good uh, suspension on this thing, road work to head. I'm in the correct lane. Like how it dropped to 55 for about a second and then right at the road works it jumps back up to... Ooh, 69. Where's the road? Holy heck, this fight, this is... Whoa. Is this the worst I've ever seen this? This has got to be the worst I've ever seen this far. It might be the uh, brightness on my screen that's making it look like this, but um, it actually looks a bit better in OBS, but I can tell you what, I can hardly see in front of me. There you go, it's causing again my, my crash to store again. <clears throat> Tell you what, the fog looks a lot better on OBS. Maybe I should turn the brightness back off. Probably makes sense since I'm not really driving through the night that often. <laughs> I love the title. <laughs> This has got to be the longest it's rained too, isn't it? Because it was raining the day before, it rained all through with sleeping. And we've been driving for four hours. <laughs> yeah, speaks the question, does it, Ozzy? Was I trying to be more economical driving on nine wheels instead of 18? Come on. Never mind, I'll change lanes. You stay there, don't worry about that. You know, don't want you to do anything like, oh, you son of a... You see that? Alfa Romeo. That explains it all. Almost did and wasn't my choice, was <laughs> it? It was his choice, so... Alright, now we've got past Mr. Magoo. I'm still enjoying this drive, even though the scenery is a bit... 
disappointing from what I was hoping for. I'm still enjoying driving this road. This is just thoroughly enjoyable. And I just can't tell you why. I really can't. Come on, aquaplaning, come on. Oh, look at that control on my behalf. Hey. <laughs> Credit where credit's due. Nah, it's 110. It was 120 for a lot of it, but um, oh, we've got an intersection. All right, back into cab view. Unless we've got. Turn left. Not much can be seen. Oh, I, can't. I think this is the worst I've seen this fog ever in this game. I'll be my um, mod. I'll be doing this anyway, but. I've had that for a long time, and I think it's a word. Uh, either way, still, statement stands. It is the worst. The worst fog I've ever seen in this game. Uh, we can go back into crash cam for this next one. <laughs> oh, ooh, slow down. I think I was slipping in the rain then. There we go. That'll be a song, Slipping in the Rain. I'm just slipping in the rain. I'm a scary feeling. But I made it again. There we go, I've rewritten the song, Slipping in the Rain. Try and copyright me now, Twitch. Turn left. I was getting a bit close that trailer to the burial there. Yeah, I can save time. Shortest distance between two points, isn't it? It's going straight. Straight to the hospital. Fog is lifting. Well, this scene is a bit different. There's bumps and lumps there. Uh, Ontario somewhere. No. I think just on the border of um, Canada and um, the US and the bottom of Ontario, whatever it's called. Ontario, Ontario. Oh, I can breathe a sigh of relief. Well, even with the scenery, about it's still it's just still enjoyable drive. Yeah, we're going. We're basically going from west to east. Actually, I'll give you a, there you go, Aussie. I'll be, give you a bit of an indication. So, we started off there, and we're heading to there, so just above the Great Lakes. One heck of a drive. Yeah, for 160 grand. 
so with it.